All right, everybody, welcome back to the South Bay Sparrow series here on NCAA 25. We are at the start of the 2027 season now, and we have to take into account how crazy and how far we've gone. Despite the record for these uh, sparrows of being four and eight consistently, I think this team is looking uh, to be uh, quite better. We are now an 82 overall team with an 84 offense. Our quarterback, sophomore Jorge Fine, to me is growing into a beast. He's already got six abilities and he is only getting better. He's got the 94 speed with the 96 acceleration, change of directions pretty high, and his throwing is only improving for the better. Uh, our halfback group, you know, we got Hardy here. He's a uh, senior redshirt, but we got some new guys that are going to be taking over. We got a freshman redshirt now in Cotton Zero. Uh, we're going to see some time from him along with Danny Free. So I'm hoping my guys can kind of work through it. Now, Free to me was one of those players that had a really good trucking ability, and I think he can do some work for us. And we still got Ian Humphreys, who's more of my third down back. So we're going to see some of these players kind of jumping in and out of our lineup there uh, we do have some new guys that are going to be taking over the helm now uh, LJ Young is still there he's got the shifty ability but we got uh, Trey Young Bell who's taking a step forward now as our junior red shirt as well as CJ Peaks so I'm hoping these guys can kind of work through it someone who's kind of dropped a little bit in the depth chart is Russ Witt he's a little smaller guy but you know, we'll see how he works out. We got a true freshman in James West that currently has made the roster right now, and I, I think he's going to be all right. Uh, from a tight end perspective, this is the area that I hope we continue to grow. We do have a freshman redshirt in Paul Merling with the purple natural, so he's just as good in the, any weather. Uh, we still got Bata here, and we do got a guy who's going to take a step forward in Robert G, who has uh, moved to depth chart three. We got Mugelli as our left tackle, Router as our left guard. We got Huff, a new center uh, for us, rocking this uh, that spot there. With Houston, a new right guard, uh, we have Green playing right tackle. So I'm hoping these guys work out. I'm excited for Couch Smith. He had a pretty decent year for us last year. And then Decker has been with us from the get, and he is only getting better. Defensive tackles, though, I'm hoping uh, for some better days for Demarius Gates, who's a sophomore now, along with Malachi Samuels. Left outside linebacker, this group is different. We got Ben Laney now on one end with Greenwood and Hartley in the middle, and he got Gates on the other side. So our guys are going to have to work through that. Jolly's now a junior, and he is going to be starting as our main corner along with Ugakwe, who is a true sophomore uh, for us. Uh, and we got Stovall and Holland still rocking it out with us too. So uh, the free safeties, we got some good guys here. Freshman red shirt, Pleasance is gonna start now, but we do got corner uh, behind him along with Roderick and Ellinger at strong safety. So I think we got a good crew. I am looking forward to getting this going, man. Our schedule isn't too crazy. Uh, we, you know, we do have Nevada as our first game along with Miami, Ohio here, or just Ohio, uh, the smaller school. And then we got Army along with the FCS Northwest. So my goal is to kind of rock some of these games here. It, we'll, we'll see how it goes. I, I, if we can get to Army, cool, but I really want to check out the Nevada and Ohio game and go from there. My hope is to kind of jump in and out of the games where I can. If I start to feel getting a little slow, we'll kind of drop in and out from there. So here we go on a late afternoon game. Nevada's going to boot this over here to the Sparrows. They're going to have it inside the end zone. They're going to take it out, though. Decent return right here by number four. He's going to get to about the 20-yard line. Not a bad return here. And here comes Jorge Fine, right? He's got the speed. He's got the arm. I think this guy could only get better. Let's get it done, guys. Shotgun deuce close here. They send three, clean pocket, hits the out route, or the, the play, like a little quick hitch right there. Bata is not the fastest guy, but he, I still believe in him, man. I think he's got some good things here. Trips left. 
They send six. Fine reads it. Hits the zig route there to the new tight end. Merling, I believe. Oh, he, got fl he got flipped over on his head. Whoa. What a smackdown right there. Tied in off the left side of that line. They're gonna hand it off to the tight end. I guess it was a no huddle scenario and they had the tight end back there. Wow, a tight end running back, huh? That's what we're doing out here? Motioning LJ. They only send three. He's got time. Goes for the deep shot. Defended. Oh, what a play right there. That was pretty good. Trips left. Third and 12. Fine reads it. Hits his receiver in the slot. That's Whip. He gets the first down. Clean pocket by Fine, huh? Fine's got a decent line in front of him now, but the Nevada's only rushing three. They're going to hand it off to Hardy for the first time today. He breaks a tackle. He gets about eight. Wow. Tied it off the right side of the line. They got six in the box. Play action here for Fine. Fine throws it. Nice catch by the tight end. Merling is getting involved early and often, folks. You got to be happy about that. We got a, a bunch left here. Off the shotgun empty bench. Fine has time. Throws it underneath to LJ. And that's going to be the first touchdown for the Sparrows. LJ connecting, right? He takes it in stride. Instead of him getting upset for being moved down in the depth chart, he takes advantage of it. He's not going to be guarded heavily, and that's going to allow him to get open. He's a junior, along with the other juniors in front of him. But Fine gets his first touchdown thro uh, throwing touchdown of the season. Now, he's a junior now. Could Fine end up being... The dude that we want him to be. Does he end up becoming the Heisman Award winning quarterback for such a small school? And if that happens, does that mean we decide we're going to move up? Who knows? I think by ne by the end of this season, we'll decide if we're going to start moving the conferences up and down and maybe we move up to the next one. As far as conferences are concerned, I'm definitely thinking about, um, uh, you know, maybe the ACC or uh, or Mountain West to kind of start it off. You know, we're going to work through that. Fake jet sweep, halfback dive right here. And the running back, nowhere to go. Can't complain right there. We got two tight ends on the left side of that line. They're going to go ahead and audible or just flip the play here. South Bay fans getting loud. They got five on the line. They're motioning over seven. Fate, oh, they go for the jet sweep. Defense wasn't ready for it. Safety's out there. Big tackle. Saved us on that one. We were in trouble, and there you go. We got ourselves a no-huddle scenario here. Trips left. Let's see what you can do. They're going to hand it off. Ooh, a little reversal there, and defense wasn't fooled. Oh, my gosh. They got to him. Second and 14. Three tight end set here. Here we go. They're motioning a receiver out of the backfield. He's got time. Gonna set his feet. Throws a nice dot right there to the tight end. Unreal. So Nevada right now currently at the 36 yard line 720 left here in this first quarter they're gonna hand it off he's gonna try to find his way through it but the defense not letting him go good job right there tied in off the right side of that line and he takes off easy run right there Ooh, is our rushing defense not that good we might have to continue to keep recruiting some guys because 
the DT space. Looks like we got some edge guys that are believing in Couch and, and Decker, but we need the interior to be figured out. Yeah, see that? Decker able to shut it down. Shotgun formation here. Tight end off the left side of the line. They're going to motion over the tight end to the right now. And look at this QB rolling around. He decides to take off. It's man coverage, it looks like. He's going to slide to the nine. It'll be third in inches here. High formation, two tight ends on the left side of that line. Motioning over the receiver, uh, the tight end from left to right. They're going to hand it off. Oh, he gets the first down. Good tackle, though. That was a close one. We got ourselves with a 5.45 left here in the first quarter. Clean pocket. Right up the middle. Oh, he just drops it. He just dropped that, huh? Kind of crazy right there. High formation. Hands it off. Three receiver set. Shotgun formation. 5.30 left here in the first quarter. Draw play here for number 20. He's going to fall forward, be down at the four. Looks like they're going to settle for a field goal here. Hold is good. Kick is good. They got themselves an easy first down right there. Oh, touch uh, field, field goal. So seven to three here. Sparrow's currently up. Four forty left. Shotgun formation here. Trips right. We're gonna hand it off. It's our first time seeing this running back here. He's a freshman red shirt. Want to give him a little opportunity today. Humphreys rocks number four, and we got Freeman with thirteen. Hardy rocket number one in the backfield. Shotgun formation, little counterplay there. Hardy's going to run, get a couple more yards. 3.30 left here in the first quarter. Empty bench, third and six. They send four here. Fine, feels the pressure. Hits it on a back shoulder throw, but the running back could not move up the field. And South Bay has to punt this off. Three minutes left here in the first quarter. High formation set, two tight ends on the left side of that line. They're going to motion the receiver from left to right. Hands it off here. And he'll get maybe a yard. Good job by the defense there. I'd say the defense, you know, they've done what they could. Uh, we, we definitely experienced quite a bit of craziness happening in our offense. But our defense, I think, can work through it. Throws it on the run. Incredible play. There might be roughing the passer. I think Decker might have got him. He did. <laughs> Decker smoked him, dude. I had a feeling he did. I definitely had a feeling he did. Uh, he went at him. Little, little, uh, little action right there. But you gotta, you gotta respect that. <laughs> I love my guys doing that, man. Clean pocket right up the middle. Wow, he hung on to it. That is unreal right there. 2.15 left here in the first quarter. Single back, trips tight end right. Right up the... Oh, a little RPO there or play action. That was sick. Gakwe. He's been getting involved today, man. Nevada calling just audibles after audibles here. Outside zone. 
Not much room there. It'll be third and five. Tied in off the right side of that line. Sideline being discussed. I'm having a discussion here with the QB. Number five throws it. Hits the hitch. Come on, man. Inside zone there. Probably first down. Touchdown. Uh, uh, for 45 seconds left here in the first quarter. Looks like a heavy rush set and somebody freaked out. Not good for them. We got ourselves a flag on the play. So that'll push them back a little bit. We'll take what we can get on that one, man. Shotgun formation. Number five throws it to the left. It's dropped. What a play right there. Oh, man. He took a nasty hit on that one. Tied in off the left side of that line. Third and goal. Defense coming in hot. And he throws it to the ground. Nobody was ready for that. Nobody was ready for that. So the bend but don't breaks does work out for us here. See if we can keep it rolling, folks. We got ourselves a 7-6 scenario here. I need the offense to do more, though. We had one nice drive, but they're going to need to start getting right because you keep letting Nevada hang on, hang around. We're going to be in trouble. We're going to return to about... Ooh, decent return by number 12. Ooh, we get to about the 21 there. Trips right. Oh, man. The little counter plays aren't really working out for us. Wide bunch right. We'll false start here. It looks like our end of the quarter. Okay, we'll figure out the next game. Let's get to the next quarter. So the Sparrows have the ball here at the 19-yard line. Second and 12. Fine just hits a check down here over to his tight end. He's been leveraging his tight end quite a bit today. Pistol. Tight end off the right side of that line. Three receiver set. 11-20 left here in the half. They send four, right on the slant, gets it to his receiver, number 18 getting the one. That's CJ speak, uh, Peaks right there. I'm waiting for him to target that guy, and glad we did. Hardy in the backfield here, shotgun formation. Tied in off the left side of that line, they're going to rush four. Fine, just steps in on that one. He's not scared at all. He looks so poised now, compared to where he was last season. Wide bunch right. They send five, finds, feels it. It's a nice freaking throw right there to Peaks. We got a shotgun tight now. Fine looking around. 9.50 left here in the half. They send five, fine waiting for it. Throws it, nice toss to the tight end. Merling has four receptions today for 61 yards. Dude is feeling it. 9.15 left here in the half. They send six, fine feels it. Oh, almost got picked. 9.13 left here in the half. Wide bunch left here for Fine. Second and 10. Fine, clean pocket. It's a nice shot to LJ there who gets about seven. LJ's already given him his first touchdown today. And he get his second one. Trips right third and three at the 24 yard line. They send four. He's got time and he's gonna take off with his legs. Look at the speed that this young QB's got, dude. Great job right there. It'll be eight minutes left here in the half. First and goal. Empty bench, trips left. They said four. Got time. Throws it to the back of the end. Oh! Wow, I thought he had that one. He takes a nasty hit. Shotgun deuce close, second and goal at the eight. They're going to hand it off, and the defense was ready for it. We lose three. Three, yeah, about three yards there. It'll be third and goal at the 12. Shotgun tight formation here. Fine, trying to get something going here. They rush five. They go for the screen to Hardy. Hardy's got some blocks. He runs past his blockers and unfortunately can't do anything there. It'd be fourth and goal. They're going to send out the field goal unit of their own. And this is a guy that we brought in. He's got the crazy leg. He's got the high concentration. And I really, really hope he continues to be our dog here, man. We need a good kicker. 
They're going to take it from the one yard line here. 636 left here. And he's going to be down at about the 20 yard line. Now Nevada likes to run no huddle. So I, hope, I think we got the right group out there that, that can mess with that. They're going to run to the weak side there. Nice cut by the running back. Number 35 gets nine on that one. 620 left here in the half. Spread formation. They are going to go ahead and take off here. And he'll get about a couple yards, but it's enough for the first down. 540 left here in the half. Wide bunch left. Green pocket. Oh, what a throw. QB just dotting it up. What a play! The safety almost got that. I got really quiet. I was like, no way are they going to get this wheel route. Shotgun formation. Second and ten. Three receiver set. This QB is very, very good. He doesn't seem worried. My D-line is not getting to him. Now, I like Decker and I like Couch Smith, but I need somebody to get to this QB. Empty bench. They send six. Yeah, see, look at that. Ooh! over under on that guy but what i'm recognizing right now is as soon as he sees us throwing uh sending more guys he just throws it over the blitz in pocket and it's picked up by jolly there you go he had a very good freshman year very quiet uh if not not so great sophomore year and he's starting the season off in his junior year with a pick take what we can get folks shotgun tight formation here they're going for the spread uh the option play there hardy's got some room there's a flag on the play and i don't get it man We're it's not even raining folks what are we even doing right now it's not even raining let's get better here come on empty bench trips right jet sweep toss right there to peaks peaks has got some i saw peaks it is peaks Number 18. I like it, man. I like it. Little counter play right there. And he's going to get a couple yards with third and seven. Shotgun tight formation. They send five. Fine feels it. Throws it right up the middle of the field. It's nice when you see throws like that, man. You see a lot of QBs throwing outside the numbers. Uh, so when you got guys doing it in the hash marks, that lets you know he's going to have better faith in uh, you know, his technique. There's a counter uh, a flag on the play. They go for the RPO. And it's going to be offsides. Offside. I like it, man. Hmm. Trips right, first and five. They're going to hand it off to Hardy. Hardy doesn't get much, if not any. Second and five. 225 left here in the half. I'd love to see what we can do here, man. They send four. Almost picked off. We almost made the mistake. Come on, guys. Let's get better. Trips left. Send four. Vine's got a clean pocket, and he, he decides to run late, and it's a fumble. Oh, my gosh. From sad to worse right there. Wow, look at Nevada. They're letting them know. They take the trident out right here against us. That is freaking messed up, man. LeVar Tally getting it done. Unreal. Wow. Clean pocket. Never mind. He gets it. So the defense fights back and they get a sack. Loss of five yards right there. Decker letting them know. Ooh. Wow. Come on. Come on. I like that call right there, man. That's pretty nice right there. 10 to 6 here, 2nd and 15. 
shotgun formation defense with uh, the sparrows with six in the box it looks like clean pocket tries to throw it nice hit dude I could say this right now my defense they are trying to make sure to knock the ball out of these guys hands here what the heck is this that is a crazy formation it's a heavy rush set for sure they thought they were gonna mess with us and unfortunately for them they're gonna settle for a punt let's get it done guys come on Ooh, that's a bad punt they're gonna start at the 23 there Okay, I like it. They're gonna send it. Oh my gosh, that could have been pick 17 that he was playing the player. Wow, come on guys. Trips right, 111 left here in the half. They just need one first down. Throws it over to the right, LJ hangs onto it, but that doesn't really do much for us. Who called it on here? Third and seven. Looks like Nevada called it. Bunch left. They send four. Fine. Feels it. Throws it to the left. Gosh, dude. Let's get it going, guys. Got to punt this off. And it's going to be a fair catch there. I'd say both sides are playing pretty well. I, I would say my offense has put my defenses in really messed up spots so far, so like to see that uh i'd like to see my defense doing a little like getting a little bit more help if possible we got a shotgun formation here defense with six in the box they only send four he throws it to the flats there he's gonna fight for the first down gets a got an additional three there roderick with his fifth tackle already dude's getting involved shotgun formation gonna rush Oh, he almost got there. A little delayed uh, rush on the left side, it looks like. Wow, man. Come on, guys. Three receiver set. He, uh, tied in off the right side of the line. Five. No word. Oh, wow. He just overthrew that one. Third and five. Come on, guys. Let's work through this here. Tied in off the, on each side of the line there. 33 seconds left. Play action here for number five. Five feels it, throws it, gets the first down. Down to the 39. They're going to use their second timeout. Come on. Throws it on the wheel route. Ooh. I, I could say this, man. My team is starting to, they're lighting people up, but I need some pressure. I, I don't know. Maybe we'll be able to find a way to recruit a bigger bigger player in the interior nice throw on the back shoulder they use their third and final timeout nevada within range to to take the lead here wide bunch left throws it to the left and it's caught unreal nevada gets down the field but that's because the offense man it's got to get stronger i don't know what we're doing right now but we are not playing great this needs to be better so we're in the second half, and Nevada has an opportunity to double dip here. They're going to return from about the three-yard line. There you go. Witt gets down the field with, with some quickness there. Trips tight end left. 11.58 left here in the third quarter. They're going to hand it off. There's a flag on the play. I'm hoping a holding call there. I am really hoping it's a holding call. There you go. We flipped the flip that one there. It'll be first and 18. Come on, guys. Two tight ends on the left side of the line, motioning a receiver. Fake jet sweep, halfback dive there for 35. He goes nowhere. He goes nowhere. I like what I'm seeing so far. Three tight ends set, two on the right, one on the left. Number five, clean pocket. Throws it over to the flats. It's caught, but barely. Doesn't really do much there. Maybe a couple yards. It's third and long here for Nevada. Clean pocket. Throws it, and it's defense. Wow. That dude jumped up crazy. So Nevada not able to do anything with their first drive. Now we are looking at, folks, a chance in great field position here. We're going to return it. And we're going to get in Nevada territory to start this off. 
Let's see if they can get it done here. Fine needs to do more. Trips left. They send four. They're going for the... Oh, wide receiver screen. That got blown up from the get, huh? <laughs> oh my gosh. Trips right. Defense coming out in a 3-3 odd. Motioning a receiver. They send it all. He throws a nice dot over the freaking middle of the field. Hits peaks there. Good catch. 9-10 left here in the third quarter. It looks like uh, they're going for a little RPO there. And look at LJ. He gets a first down. I like it, man. Come on. Drips left. We're at the 25. 8.30 left here in the third quarter. They send five. Oh, my gosh. That, that dude was boxed. There was four dudes around him. We got to be better than that, man. Spread formation here. 8.25 left here in the third quarter. Motioning receivers. They got some mesh concept. Throws the wheel run. Cup. Touchdown. South Bay. What a throw to LJ. He's got two TDs today. What are you, What is going on, man? LJ Young. Third on the depth chart. And he took advantage of that. There was a little motion. There was a couple of meshes. And the O-line held up too. Incredible. But look at this catch by LJ. He took a nasty hit by the DB, but he didn't give up. And now the Sparrows have regained the lead here with 825 left in the third quarter. I like that, man. Keep it rolling, young man. Keep it rolling. You're going to take it from the six. And they'll start to drive the 18. Two tight ends on the left side of that line there. They're going to check down to number 88, who can't get too far. He's going to be down at the 23-yard line. 8-10 left here in the third quarter. Motioning receiver. Jet sweep there. Oh, wow. 83 tried to course correct, and that ends up being the worst decision he's ever made. We got eight minutes left here in this third quarter. Third and six. Can the defense do it once again? Ooh, looks like uh, they're coming out. They just flipped the play here. Three tight end set. Defense with four on the line. They're going to play action this. He's got time. Throws it up the... Wow. Oh, he dropped it. Oh, my gosh. That was a throw and a half by that QB. That guy's really good. I don't think it was his fault, man. That is an incredible throw. Wow, that boot was long. Witt doesn't want to go down. He's going to fight to get to the 45 there. So first and 10 at the 45-yard line. Shotgun tight formation here. 7.30 left here in the third quarter. They're rolling it out. He's got time. Nice throw there to Peaks, who goes out of bounds. Seven minutes left here in the third quarter. Tied in off the left side of that line. Inside zone there. We haven't really ran the ball that much today, but Hardy gets about four on that one. You know, he wants to run a little bit more. I got enough running backs to run more, but you know, Fine's a pretty good QB. Our tight end's been pretty dynamic today. Play action here. Fine looking around, throws it to the right. Nice catch. 251 yards and two touchdowns today. He does have a turnover. It was a fumble he, draw, he lost. Uh, 540 left here in the third. Outside zone there. Hardy's got some room. He's going to get about two on that one. Shotgun dues close. Have time. Have time. Fine. Throws it on the run. Oh, man. I thought that was a great throw. Just a little late. Third and eight here at the 18-yard line. They send four. Fine. Feels it. He's going to take off with his legs. He's going to get the first down. He's going to fight down at the two. Or he fine. You got to watch him, dude. The dude's got the speed. Pistol formation here. They're going to hand it off. And Hardy dives into the end zone. That's back-to-back -back touchdowns here in the second half for the Sparrows. 23 to 13 extra point coming in it will be 24 to four, uh, 13 
Se uh, 417 left, man. I like it. I like it a lot. Let's see what we can do here in this one. They're going to take it from the six. And he will be down at about the 22-yard line there. Let's keep it rolling. Fighting off the right side of the line. Jet sweep there for number nine. He breaks the tackle. And everybody just lets the man go after that. Unreal. Unreal. Ooh, play action here for number five. He's got time. Good play right there. Good play right there. A little uh, change at the line here. Inside zone. Bounces off a defender. He's going to get about four there. All right, guys. Come on. They're making a change at the line. Single back formation. They're motioning a receiver. Big jet sweep. Half back dive for 35. 35 is going to fight for it. This is a pretty big running back. 3.15 left here in the third quarter. Tied in off the left side of that line. RPO. Breaks a tackle. 12's got the, the entire... Oh my gosh. We were running cover zero, huh? Is that what we're doing out here? On Rio, we're running cover zero. And they're gonna go for the two-point conversion to get down by two, uh, by by a field goal. 305 left here in the third quarter. Five's trying to run around. He's got nowhere to go. Big sack by the defense. That's Couch Smith right there. Spears trying to do something, but pressure came in too good. We're up by five. So we kick a field goal, we go up a full possession. All that just means like we're gonna we're gonna have more control here. Turner doesn't want to go down. Number 12 has been doing pretty solid to get to the 20. Tied in off the left side of that line here. Seven in the box. They're going to hand it off to Hardy on the inside split. Only going to get about two there. Shotgun dues close. Hands it off. Oh, a little read option this time. And Fine almost got away. He knows it. I think if he just would have gotten out to the edge, man, that was it. I think he was going to run it in. 150 left, third and seven. They send five. Nice shot to the Merling. Merling is becoming such a nice target for us. The guy plays so well, man. Tied in off the left side of that line. Nevada goes for a... Did we, did we just screw that up there? Unreal. 112 left here in the third quarter. Motioning the receiver. Got time. Hits it underneath here to 21. 21 is going to get about 8 there. 35 seconds left here in the third quarter. Shotgun deuce close. Little RPO there to the flats. Tight end doesn't go down. After the last two ta uh, attempts, it takes four guys to take the man down. And we are looking at... 20 seconds left here in the third quarter. Pistol formation now. I love what's happening. How am I got We're doing no huddle here. Taking advantage of that roster that's out there. And there's an outside zone and Hardy is gone. He's going to take it. Touchdown, South Bay. Oh, my goodness. Ooh, he pulls out the Heisman. So, South Bay has had some players showing up today on the offense. Uh, LJ, Jr., has two touchdowns. Hardy comes in with a big run right there at the end. This is in his senior year. And uh, good blocking up field. I got some pretty big receivers now. I, I, you know, it's just Witt who's the shorter guy, but everyone else is like six foot. I think I got one six foot guy, the rest are six two. So I want bigger targets for fine. I want to make sure he's ready to roll. So hopefully we can keep it going there. Can't be too upset about that. They're going to take it from the four. And it'll be down at the 18. High formation set here. They're going to take it. And he doesn't go down. And 20's going for a long run. Number 11 trying to chase him down. He hits him hard. He hit him hard. But he already gained a huge chunk of change right there. 
Ugakwe lit the man up here to end the third quarter. But Nevada on their way. Both teams starting uh, to uh, to uncork on each other. They're, they they don't want to mess around. They need to keep scoring. Now, Nevada's down by two possessions. They have to put some points on the board here. I formation set. They're going to hand it off. He tries to cut back, and the defense is there, and they're ready. 11.50 left here in the fourth. 31 to 19. They're making a change here at the line. Single back formation here. Clean pocket. Throws it underneath to the tight end. Tight end had some room. No one was expecting him to get the ball. I wonder if that was a delayed route because I'm, I'm wondering why he was just wide open like that. I formation here. Two tight ends on the left side of that line. Defense with six on the line themselves. They're going to pass the ball. He's not worried. Hits it underneath. And the receiver hangs on to it. It'll be first and 10 at the 26-yard line. 11 15 left here in this one. Two tight ends on the left side of the line. Receivers right next to him on the left. Tied it, uh, the running back looks tired. Quarterback's going to pass it. Throws it. Back shoulder throw. Oh my gosh. What a hit. That dude should have died. Unreal. Trips right. They're going for an outside zone. Defense not letting the man. Oh my gosh. Wow, they didn't give him a first down. I, oh wait okay he was out a yard short that running back is insane third and two here six in the box qb making a change of the line he's checking down i think he's gonna run it i think he's gonna no big jet sweep no nope, we're not fooled we push the qb back he's in trouble he's gonna try to take off running defense bouncing he's bouncing off everybody and they get to him couch smith 55 they light the man up and they tell him what's up now, they kick the field goal here. It's about a 41-yarder, right? They're going to be down by a full possession. But knowing that for us, we just kick another field goal, and we don't have to worry about it. We put these guys in a desperate uh, mode here. Have them just play one-dimensional and allow our defense just to eat. We're going to return it there, and that is not the greatest of returns. Number 12 is going to be down at the 17. 10 minutes left here. Fine. Playing as the sun is setting. They send five or four there. Fine. Sets his feet. Throws it to the left. Big catch right there. That's Merlin. Unreal is that tight end, dude. He is very good. I had to go for a tight end, uh, and I'm glad we snagged him up at the transfer. Trips right here. Little pump fake. Fine. Sets his feet. Gets it to the wide receiver screen there, and ends up being the tight end. He doesn't want to go down. He fought for those two yards for sure. Clock is ticking here. We got our trips left. 9.05 left here in this one. Read option. Oh, little RPO. No one was ready for it. And there's a flag on the play. That, he kind of held on to it way too long there. The O-line was not expecting it. Isaiah Crowder, offensive pass interference. What? Did he block? Oh, maybe he blocked somebody up the field. Little draw play right there for Hardy. Hardy's going to get a couple yards there. Nothing too crazy. It'll be third and long at the 34-yard line. Shotgun tight. I'm hoping my def my offense can, can convert here, but this is not an easy one. They send four. Fine. Throws a deep shot, and it's picked off. That was a bad throw. He wanted to get it to his uh, to the guy he relies on, though, today. He's relied on today in LJ Young. But that'll be a turnover there. Two tight ends on the right side of that line for Nevada. Throws a slant. Oh, wow. I don't even know how he caught that. I thought we were going to break that up. Single back formation. Two, uh, three tight end set. Two on the left, one on the right. Defense with five in the box. Nevada looking to set. They're going to hand it off to 35. 35 is going to get the first down. That's, the, that's, the, that's important right there. Give your offense a new set of downs. And just keep chewing the clock. They're going to hand it off to 35 again. 35 finds so much room. He's an incredible running back. He's definitely pretty good there. Shotgun formation, 7.15 left here in this one. Tight end on the right side of the line. They're motioning receiver. Jet sweep there. And the tight end's going to get about three. Can't be upset about that one. Shotgun formation. Tight end off the right side of the line. They're going to hand it off. 35 cutting back to the middle of the field. 
He gets three when he probably could have lost two. No huddle scenario for them, it looks like. That's their game plan. 6.45 left here. Tied in off the left side of that line. Clean pocket. He's got time. What a play. Number 11 with an acrobatic block right there. It'll be fourth and four. Nevada knows you got to go for it. There's too far for a field goal. They got some time. He's going to decide to run it. It's a turnover. Fumble, fumble, fumble. Picked up. Turnover and downs. 55 getting to the QB here. That was unreal. The amount of pressure that came through. The QB just decided to collapse. Ellis Berry, the junior here. Now that was Decker who broke through. Yep, it was Decker who caused that chaos. I'm surprised how good that guy is, man. He's He's been nice for us. Shotgun tight, 635 left here. They send four. Fine has time, and that is a bad decision. He's got to be better than that, dude. That was stupid. Wide bunch left. 631 left here in this one. They send three. Fine has time. Hits a check down there to 21, and he's going to get about seven there. 555 left. Two tight ends. Oh, no. Check, check, check. Only one tight end on the left side of the line. They're going for a Wildcat, and they get it. Wow, I didn't even realize it was Wildcat. Like it. They gave Fine a little break there. Trips right. 515 left here in this one. They send three only. Fine. Not worried about it. Throws it on the run. Gets it to his receiver, who's going to fall just a little short of the first down there. It'll be second and inches. Keep drawing the clock, man. Just waste it. Oh, they're going for the screen. Gets it to Ward. Uh, Hardy. Hardy hangs on to it. Man, I kind of just wish he would have stepped like back a little bit. Took the block, and then he probably would have had another 10 there. Tied in off the left side. Of, oh, empty bench. Hits a zig route there to LJ, who doesn't go down on the initial hit. That's five yards there. Look at the clock going down. These guys are not giving up, man. Trips left. 325 left here in this one. They send four. Fine. Clean pocket. Sets his feet. Throw the back. Oh, no. What a miss. Freaking step right there by this quarterback. Jorge Fine had such a rhythm. All we had to do is just relax. He could have ran the ball. He had the screen on the left. And he went for it. He wanted three touchdowns today. So now the defense has to get back out there as they currently... Oh, they're down by nine. So they got to score quickly. They got to score quickly. Maybe that's why the field goal probably would have been a good idea for them. Uh, 3.05 left here. I thought they were only down by... Eight. I thought they were down by eight, but I guess not. I was wrong there. Ooh, I'm bad with numbers. Three minutes left here. They're going to empty bench uh, this one here off this motion. 2.55. Clean pocket. Five throws a shot, hits the dude in the ankles. Second and 10, 2.53 left. Tied in off the left side of that line. Defense with six in the box. They send four. He sees it, throws it to the middle, and it's caught by the tight end, who gets all the way to the 31. They're going to no huddle this. Defense needs to get it going, man. They're down by two possessions, guys. All we got to do is just sit, chill, feel good. Motioning. No motion there. Five. Feeling it. Throws it for an out route. Just out of reach at number 12. That was a good play concept, though. 229 left here. Second and 10. Tied in off the right side of that line. They're looking. Looking. No! Big fumble! 55 with the... He laid that man out. 55 with the kill. Decker and 55 next to each other is kind of a dangerous combo there. Third and 15. 210 left here. They're going to motion the receiver out, uh, the running back out. So, again, empty bench. See what they do here. They send four. Pressure coming in. Up the middle. What a catch. Touchdown. Unreal. Oh, my gosh. You can't make this up right now, man. That was an incredible throw right there. You got to give him that. Devontae Brazil gets open on a post pattern. Great throw right there. 11, uh, I think he's our freshman redshirt. He got beat on that one. So here you go, folks. Nevada down by two. They're going to kick this here. 
my thoughts are they're going to try to kick it in the end zone as hard as they can to ensure they can get a touchback. But nope, now we're going to get at least past the two-minute warning. So Nevada has no choice. They have to use their freaking timeouts. But here's my thing. If we can get a first down here, there is a huge chance we could just end it here. Hands it off to Hardy. He breaks one tackle. He fights for that yard. Nevada calls their first timeout. Two timeouts remaining here. Pistol bunch right. Defense playing super aggressive. Finds looking. I'm assuming he's going to run it again. Nope. They're going to pass it. Love this. Aggre no! He got sacked. They call another timeout. It's all good. It's all good here. Wildcat is the call. They know they just got to run it and force Nevada to have to do something. Hardy right up the middle. He doesn't want to go down. Oh, my God. Oh, my gosh. He got all the way down the field. Unreal. Game is over on a Wildcat. What just happened? That's going to do it, folks. Nevada loses off a hardy run. <laughs> I thought it was going to be crazy. Oh, my gosh. Fine saying thank for, thanks for pulling me out of that one. He had uh, 85 yards, 15 rushes today. 85 yards on 15 rushes and two touchdowns. Hardy had a good game for us. I'd like to say, you know, Fine had a good game to a certain extent. He was playing well up until that last pick. Uh, he had two turnovers today. He's got two picks today, two uh, touchdowns, two interceptions. He's got two, 339 yards today, so that's not bad. From a rushing perspective, 15 for 85. Fine, seven for 18. Get a fumble along with those two picks. Two touchdowns for LJ Young today, but Merlin was the man of the hour. Our tight end, nine for 126. Uh, you had uh, Treyun Bell, number 21. That's who it is. Five for 65. Uh, Young, six for 61 and two tutties. And then Peaks, four for 36. Uh, from a blocking perspective, only one sack happened, and it was the running back's fault. Double digit tackles for Roderick and Greenwood. So these are some new guys here that are getting some time out there. Four tackles for loss. Uh, for Barry and Decker, so 55 and 98 getting, and but Couchsmith 49, not, not too far behind. Two sacks for Barry, one for Decker, half for Gates and Smith, one pick by Jolly. So, I like it, man. I like the work here. Let's see if we can keep it rolling. I don't think we're gonna do the second game here. Maybe we'll just kind of let the season debut be what it is. But I'll kind of talk through some of the recruits that we are looking at here after we advance. But that's a good game uh, right there. Let's check out what uh, it's coming up here. As you can see, I got a lot of players. They all like me. They all want to play for us. So all I can say is, please, 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 but look at this championship contender. Moves up, program tradition, moving up. Looks like we're 41, uh, we're ranked 41. Wow, okay, I like it, I like it. Let's keep it keep it going there. Eric Bear, Ellis Berry ends up being the American Defensive Player of the Week. Had a pretty good game, uh, I can respect it. And that actually, stats were good enough to make him National Defensive Player of the Week. Ooh, I like it. So we're not going to play Ohio. I want to make sure I find the true gems and take my time with it. And who knows, you know, we'll find some three-star guys that'll really work out for us. I think we got a good crew. You know, I, I would say our, our team is pretty solid um, so far. You know, we kind of got a little lucky there, um, but, we, you know, we'll work through it. No one in, no one for me, yeah, no one in, in our conference has brought anybody in, but... I think you know we're going to continue to to do what we need to do. I I like it so far. It looks like we got championship contender. We got program tradition moving up. Prestige is where it's at. Conference prestige. I think the more we continue to grow these things, the better. We just have to kind of continue to uh, find that value there. And the positive is it doesn't look like many people want to leave our school. So. But that'll do it for us today, everybody. If you like what you saw, please drop a like, leave a comment, tell me what you think, and most importantly, subscribe to keep up with the series. I'm actually pretty excited about this series, man. We're in 2027 now, so more of my players, more of my vision is starting to show up. Um, I'm, I'm thinking we're going to keep it moving, man, and the hope is we get ourselves to a new conference down the road, and um, we keep building on it, and 
fight for the natty one day but let's see what we can do until next time everybody as always let's go south bay